In this tutorial, I'll show you how to connect your HP LaserJet M110WE to your PC Windows computer. And I'll also show you how to print using your computer. So let's get started right away. If it's the first time you're setting up your printer and you just press the power button, you should see the Wi-Fi logo over here that is flashing in a blue color. This means that this printer is ready to get paired. If yours is not flashing in a blue color, don't worry, I'll show you how to activate the wireless feature of this printer. If yours is flashing, just skip the step I'll show you next. Okay, so what you need to do to activate the pairing mode is, well, turn on your printer and then press on this Wi-Fi icon over here during at least 20 seconds until you see the power button flashing and this exclamation point flashing as well. So let's do it together. I start pressing and I won't release until I see these two um, buttons flashing. So I'm just waiting. It will take some time, maybe as I said, 20 seconds. Here we go. The power button is now flashing. I still won't release it until I see this exclamation point um, lighting up. Okay, it's lighting up. Now I can release and you'll have to wait about 30 seconds until the printer shuts down and powers back on again. You don't have to touch anything during all this. So let's just wait. I'll accelerate the video so you don't have to wait while this is happening. Okay, so the printer shut down and now is powered back on. And as you can see now, the Wi-Fi icon over here is flashing. Great, we're ready to go to the next step. On your PC, what you need to do is to open the Microsoft Store and you need to download the HP Smart app. So just tap HP Smart on the top and you should see it appearing. Just click the download button and once it's done, click open. This is the main screen of the app. If you have other printer connected, you're gonna see them here. If not, no problem. You should see connect your first printer button appearing and you should click on it. If you don't see it, like in my case, click on this icon over here or there is a printer with a plus sign on the left side. Then you have to wait. You'll see a list of all the available printers around you and your should be right on the top, HP M110. Click on Setup. Then click continue, click no thanks. Make sure this is your Wi-Fi network at your home or office and then type the password of this network because now we're connecting your printer to the Wi-Fi. Once you type your password, click connect. At this step, they'll ask to press the Wi-Fi button, so go ahead and press this button once, like this. And the setup will continue on your computer. Once you see the screen, press continue. Now I suggest you press manage options and make sure every single dam is unchecked, then press continue. If you see this one check, just press on it until it's unchecked and press continue. Now at this step, HP will try to sell you their subscription service. And it's a bit sneaky the way they do it. I don't like it. Their uh, HP Plus service, what it means is that you're going to pay a certain amount each month and they will allow you to print a certain amount of pages each month without you to have to purchase any ink toner. There's one important thing that they don't tell you. And this is a very important one. Once you subscribe to their service, even if in the future you unsubscribe and you don't want it anymore, HP will force you to use original HP ink toners for your printer. You won't be able to get those cheap third-party ones that you find on Amazon and other websites that usually cost three times, four times less. They will force you to buy for the rest of the life of your printer HP branded toners. And I think it's very, very unfair. 
so it's up to you to choose maybe you still want hp plus again if you agree with their terms and condition well it's up to you so what i suggest is you press exit setup because the printer is connected to your uh, computer they don't tell you this they really want you to get the service so i'll go and press exit setup they will even warn you setup incomplete printer won't work until setup is finished this is not true this is very sneaky from hp they're trying to sell you their subscription service just press exit setup and i'll show you that it works okay exit setup so we're back on the main screen of the app and they will warn you here with an exclamation mark finish setup again it's not true you can actually start printing the only thing you need to do before uh, starting printing is that you need to connect over here on the top right corner to your hp account this is free this is has nothing to do with the hp plus i just talked about hp forces you to connect to your account to be able to print with your computer or even smartphone again this is a sneaky way but at least it's free it takes just a few seconds and you can print right away so connect to your uh, account because if not you won't be able to do anything else once you're done uh, connecting to your account press print document and we're going to print a document here press ok select the document from your pc the one you want to print let's say i want this one press print they'll give you a preview and you'll be able to select the different settings regarding your print so over here the letter the paper size paper type output quality how many copies you want you can go down over here page range if you want to print just a certain amount of page just edit these settings uh, the way you want and before pressing the print button don't forget to put some paper in the paper tray before printing i forgot to tell you just make sure that your printer is selected on the top you should say laserjet m110w this is important since if you select another printer uh, nothing will connect and then press the print button when you're ready and here we go this is the document we just printed so you see even if it says over here finish setup this is not true don't fall into their trap this is just so they get you on their subscription service you can actually start using your printer as you just see normally and it should just work so thanks for watching i hope this video was useful if so please leave a like subscribe to my channel check the affiliate amazon links in the description if you want to get some more ink for your printer and i'll see you in the next video